Hi everyone, how are you doing? Today we are talking about a brand new subscription to our channel. So this is the Busy Bee Stationery subscription. This is what the outer packaging looks like. Um, before we get started, I just want to remind you that I do have a giveaway currently going on as the 20th of this month. You can enter to win the ABA for Vera palette, their brand new spring release. That link for the giveaway video will be down in the description box. So since this box is new to um, both me and this channel, I pulled up their website. So I will give a little description so we can learn more about the subscription company. It says, we run a monthly stationary subscription for busy bees. We enjoy the feeling of putting pen to paper. We love to journal. We are mad about planners. We like to stay in touch with loved ones the old fashioned way. Each month we send our subscribers a curated box of beautiful stationery. The contents are always a surprise. Our boxes typically, typically include five to 10 items. We choose items that inspire creativity and help you with your everyday note-taking, planning, journaling, and letter writing. Our boxes are always built around a theme, season, or specific creative project. Make sure you keep in touch with us on Instagram and Twitter using the hashtag BusyBeeStationery. All right, and let's see how much this costs. All right, so um, this Busy Bee Stationery box costs $39.90 per month with free USA shipping and they do um, have worldwide shipping available. So this is available everywhere, which is awesome. Uh, I'm guessing shipping varies based on your location, but if you are within the United States, then it is free. So let's get unboxing and see what is in here. I have no idea. I have not looked at any spoilers or any other videos. All right, when I open up the box, I see some tissue paper that has bees on it, which is super cute. And underneath it, this is what I see. So I will just take one thing out at a time and show you guys. So the first thing I see, it looks like these are paper clips, butterfly paper clips. They're super cute. This is by, um, I think it's Heidi Swap Embellishments Decorations. And this is what they look like. Hopefully it's not too reflective, the packaging. So I don't think there's a card in here with like pricing or anything like that. Um, but I'll let you know if I do come across this. So these are cute. Um, here, let me take it out so I can really show you. So here they are um, without the outer packaging. There's like different layers of it. This is really cute. Like they seem pretty well made and not just cheap. Sometimes you've seen like, you could see these things like just hot glue gun or something like that. How do I get you off? So here is what one of them looks like. So you can kind of see there's like different layers to that butterfly. It's pretty. So this is totally cute. Uh, and then there's a pair of scissors. Oh my, I think these are scissors that like cut in a specific shape, which is really cute when you're cutting out stationery and doing fun crafts. Um, let's see, is this focusing? You can see the design in the, like right in the center, but this is what it looks like. And this is by um, Eck Tools. So this is a fun thing to have. I don't have anything like this. I just have regular scissors. I'm gonna try it out. I kind of messed it up in there. You could see the um, how it cuts there. That's cute. Ooh, I'm excited about this. The next thing I see is metallic markers. There's five of them. It says um, there's gold, dorado, silver, argent. Wait, are they just saying these in different languages? Gold, silver, and black. <laughs> I'm like trying to read like what it is in a different language. Um, this is metallic ink for dark and light papers. So this is what it looks like. It looks like they're, yeah. I'm really excited about the gold. So there's two gold, two silver, and one black. I am super excited to use the gold especially, but silver too will look really good on darker paper. And on the back it says, this marker is opaque metallic paint-like ink, allows you to write with no mess on both light and dark paper for any surface. It's acid-free, fade-proof, waterproof, and non-toxic. Let's try out one of them. So I pulled out one of the gold, um, and this is by American Crafts, if I did not say that earlier. Ooh, there 
here's the tip of it. So let's write something. I love it. It even wrote pretty well on this like slippery paper, you know, like this is like coated with something. It's not just regular paper. That is fun. I love the gold. I'm going to use this all the time. Yay. Let's just try silver for the heck of it. I think we all know what black looks like, right? Oh my god, silver is really cool too. So yeah, these are awesome. I'm excited about this the most so far. Yay. And then I see, um, this is by Jen Hadfield Homemade Scallop Tape. And this is like in this pretty gold color. It feels cool too. So what do you do, with, what is scallop tape? Oh, it kind of, you can kind of see it, um, that there, it is in the scallop print. So I guess it's just, you can use the tape probably on like the edges of like a craft project. I'm like thinking of some like poster board that would have this around the edges. But this is cool, let me open it. So here are like three pieces. So that's the scallop print and it is a pretty gold color. So this is fun. So you just um, take the backing off and tape it on wherever you want. Feels cool. I've never had anything like this. I'm trying to think what I'll do with it. Something like this, like you could just keep in your craft drawer and when it comes in handy, that's nice to have. So then I see a little notepad. It says um, there's 40 sheets in here. It's by Studio um, 112 and it says Bling It On. I have so many notepads, but I'm a list maker. I already made a list today. I'll probably make another one at some point today, so I'm happy to have this. <laughs> Oh, and there is a piece of paper here that says, Welcome to Busy Bee Stationery. The theme for March is teal coloring. So I, there is a card that comes in here. It doesn't list all of the items on here, but it tells you what the theme is, which is cool, and also what brands come in the box. And then this is the back of the paper. The next thing I see looks cool. Oh my god, look how pretty this notebook is. I love the print of it in the white and black with this like teal color. I love this. Um, and on the back it says this is by Hall Pass. It's 80 pages. Let's see if it's just like blank or it looks like they're lined pages on the inside. So there's this pretty color. I love this color scheme. And then just like regular lined um, paper. And it's double sided. Awesome. This is so cute. What should I use this for? I love this so much. Awesome. All right, getting towards the bottom. And this is by Heidi Swap. This is a stamp and stencil kit. This is cute. So, so is this a stencil? Is that what it? Oh no, it's a stamp. I've gotten these before and I was confused. Okay, so this is it. It says in a heart. So that must be the stamp. And then in the back, this is a stencil. Um, I guess that's Heidi in the back. I don't know if maybe like people really into stationery and stuff know her. Um, it says for daily ideas and inspiration, you can follow her. So that's cool. This is cool. You guys have to give me some ideas. Are you guys really into the, like stationery and stuff like that? I like. I'm starting to collect a lot, and this is all so cute. I need some ideas of how to use all of this. So please let me know. And then it looks like there's one more thing in here. This looks cool. I love markers. This is another one by American Crafts. This is a galaxy marker. Uh, it says paint like ink for dark and light paper. And it looks like it's going to be this pretty green color. And it has a thinner tip than the other markers that came in that package of five. That is the color on top. Hopefully you guys can see it. That's pretty. It is like a... It's not teal, I wouldn't say, but it looks 
it's like more of a green color, but yeah, I like this. I love stuff like this. So, I mean, I'm probably the most excited about all the markers. So I think that is everything. Let's just do a quick recap. So we have the pack of the gold and silver and black uh, metallic markers. And then we have a galaxy marker by the same company. I love all these. There is the scallop tape, a notepad, this craft scissors, this um, stencil and stamp kit, this super cute little journal. I'm so excited about this. I need to figure out what the use will be. I have like a journal for everything already, but I need this in my life now. <laughs> um, and then there are, and then there's these cute little butterfly paper clips. Here's that one. So I think this is cute. All this stuff is so fun. I'm excited to use it. It is a little bit more expensive than other stationery boxes I have gotten, but I do find that this is more of a variety than other boxes. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. Do you like this box? Do you subscribe to it? Do you want to see more stationery boxes? Because I do have a few in my pile that's got ever growing right next to me. I'm looking over it now. I've got some videos to film. Um, but anyways, just to wrap this video up, I will tell you what I have in my eyes. So I've got like an itch for some reason on my eyebrow. So I'm sorry if I'm being boring again. I plan to film later tonight and I'll probably redo my makeup. But I am just loving some of these, the mustard shade in this palette. So um, like I said in the beginning of the video, I am doing a giveaway. And until that giveaway ends, I am using this palette every day because I bought one for myself. Um, so I could show you guys looks with it and also give you my opinion and verdict is I love it. I like everything about it. Um, I am just loving this mustard shade, um, Cabana. So I just put a state in Cabana in my crease and then I use the brown shade, which I really like too, um, palm all over my lid. And then I just use my finger and put some of this pretty golden brown um, on my lid. So super easy pretty look this is like my favorite look to go i know this is such a bright palette but you can do neutral looks with it like it's pretty early in the day right now and i have to go to the grocery store and stuff i just didn't want to have like purple on my lids um but i'll probably do it later on today at least tomorrow i will do a more colorful look because i know the last few looks have been a little bit more neutral and i want to show you more diversity with this palette um i have done some bold looks though in the past if you watch some of my videos but anyways, thank you so much for unboxing with me. The link to the subscription along with my giveaway will be down in the description box. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.